today i am standing in one of the most expensive gym in kerala whoa this is one of the cheapest gym i could find in my city so scary to put the weights here bro and today i will be testing this gym checking their amenities and rating it out of 10 but before showing you the most expensive gym in kerala let me show you how a cheapest gym in kerala looks like all right this is one of the cheapest gym i could find in my state uh i'm pretty sure there are gyms cheaper than this but this is one of the cheapest gym i could find if you want to know about the membership here bro trust me it's way way cheaper than the most expensive gym but before i tell you how much the gym actually costs let us check the vibe the equipments and the amenities the gym is named international fitness and this is the entrance like literally the way i just entered that's that how we enter like there's no entrance for the gym this is a locker room which i'm quite impressed bro like it's pretty nice if this is where you can keep your bags bro like i trust my people in kerala so i can just leave my bag here it's now let's get ready for our workout take a pre workout start pumping pumping and then check all the equipments all right okay now it's time to get our pre workout in for the insane pump i'll feel, i'll feel like arnold today bro the all new rathex is packed with innovation and brings together intense doses of caffeine citalin and beta alanine blended with branded ingredients like kriya pure bio parine and nitro blaze this pre workout is built to make every rep feel stronger every pump bigger and every set more powerful well get ready to experience unstoppable strength and endurance right after you take this also if you guys are using muscle brace product please use code edwinmb to get some additional discount also to support me in their website and i got to be honest the muscle braces i think this is the cola frost i guess Yeah, cola, cola frost, pretty insane, bro. I love the, love the flavor, and gives you insane pump. I'll show you. I'll show you. I don't need any. I don't need no lighting to show you the insane pump, bro. Like this one scoop is enough. While I was searching for water, I faced a problem which I never expected. We didn't have any place to fill water here, so we got to buy uh, a liter of water and then fill, because. That's pretty bad. I won't lie. That's 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 not good. So we'll be eating push today, and before that, let's check if they have bench, squat, and deadlift platform. Let's go. Hey, all the plates here are metal. You feel hard when holding. Pause, 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 pause. pause. That's not what I meant. That's good. Oh yeah. Genuinely feels heavy, bro. I don't know, how, bro. This is 10 kg and it genuinely feels heavy. It feels heavier than 10 kg, trust me. I'm having this brain fog, bro, because of my. I'm literally out of breath and this. Like I can smell. It doesn't smell good. Not gonna lie, the ventilation was definitely a downside here. For me. Hey, that's my banger song, bro. That's a banger song. Uh, I'm I'm pretty sure the voice is going to be the noise is going to be pretty bad because of the song and if I have to talk about the music here it's pretty random sometimes they play malayalam sometimes they play tamil but bro i i still i still like my malayalam and tamil songs is my uh, favorite tamil actor vijay song over here well even though i didn't have any problem with the music here i might have had some issues with the rules in this gym so i was just gonna do bench press and the trainer approached and he was like you know what you cannot do this if you do not have a towel i don't sweat usually that but bro here like The ventilation is quite bad. So in this gym, there are quite some rules that is to be followed. One, you cannot train without using a towel. Two, you need to get your own water bottle. And three, you cannot wear sleeveless tops. But since it was my first day, they let me. I was given a special consideration. 
But apparently there was a complaint registered to the head trainer here regarding me wearing sleeveless. This was the only issue I found in this gym and that is why the vibe I would give it a 6 out of 10. Anyways, now it was time to check the equipments and the maintenance. What are deadlift platform over here and it's pretty insane bro like look at the deadlift platform I don't think I've ever lift I think most of the deadlift platforms are made of wood but this setup is for the first time that's pretty insane bro like I genuinely love working out here this being my first day that equipment already feels very smooth I gotta rate this on pump Bro, I think I would give this a gym solid 10 on 10 because it's pretty solid. I, I just did two sets and I feel good. Dumbbells here feel pretty solid. God, I feel good holding the dumbbells itself. Easy. Okay, fuck. Damn, that feels. That felt a little skeptical. The bench just moved while I was sitting my last rep. Gotta stop here, I guess. We got. We got our pet flies here, some abductors. Oh, we got a triceps, bro. This is the OG one. Uh, we got your close grip rowing over here. And let me try uh, the pet flies. This, this is the one you see. You see Riyas Khan working out <laughs> in these ones. That, oh, God. Bro. Okay. Stretch you feel here is amazing and the contraction is way way better bro beautiful bro i won't lie every single machine here hits the right spot the right spot i'm so used to the commercial gym lighting and this gym lighting feels so weird to me. I don't know, like, the moment I look at them, I feel very weird. It feels like I'm... I don't know, it doesn't feel like a gym for me. I can't believe that commercial gyms, you know, the mindset they have put in our head, like how a gym should actually look like, and how a gym usually... how a gym used to look like, it's completely different, bro. And I can't believe that... and that people in our generation go to the gym for the lighting, I mean, myself, bro. When I go to the gym, I first see the lighting, then the dumbbells, equipments, and everything. But here, we know that people come here to actually grind hard and not just to bloody look at the lighting and I don't know, bro, what else? No, I'm in mercenary. Yeah, I'm in Navy. Yeah, I'm a fourth ranking officer over there. Yeah, I'm right? Mr. Dickey and uh, Mr. Kerala also and Mr. Bangalore also. Mr. Bangalore also? Yeah, yeah. Damn. So, I want to ask you bro, like how long have you been working out here? I've been working out here for around like three years. Why do you come to this gym when that gym is... Because this is my home gym. Okay. So I start my workout over in here. 2009. Uh, uh, I, my career begin from here. So these are old kind of missionaries where you'll be getting the best acute areas exactly. you'll be... Yeah, that's, that's what you'll be getting. Same, bro, like but in other kind of gyms, if you're going, there will be a lot of other machines where you'll not be even be feeling. Uh, feeling the pain and you'll not exactly. be feeling that sort of thing. That's it, that's it. I mean, you'll be getting... I mean, all the things are like uh, adjustments on the... I mean, the angles over there. Okay. So you'll be having pretty good angles over here and you'll be also finding it a little bit hard to... Press all exactly. this kind of stuff. The weight fields are much heavier yeah. than 10 kgs, bro. Yeah. Okay, so... These are all steel plates over here. If you go to other gyms and all, you'll be having a rubber coatings. If the rubber coatings go, then it will be like partially imbalanced. Right, right. All this. Uh, the equipment name is already... Uh, company name is fitness, International Fitness. Oh, the, the company name is International Fitness? Making angles our particular body parts. Okay. See, if, if you are... For example, this is the lat pull down. So, this is old school. All are old school machines. Okay. So if you are hitting the correct position, like hitting this we'll hit part, the right muscles. Part. Right muscles. Okay. Alright, we are done with the workout finally. And we got to check the amenities these guys got. First, we saw the locker room. Now let's see what else do they got here. Come on. Alright, so first amenity we got here is a weighing machine. Yeah, boys, this this is a weighing machine. I don't know how to operate this, but this is the old school weighing machine. People weigh their uh, weight here. They add on the weight and they balance it it's it's pretty insane because i'm seeing this after a long long time bro what else do they got come here they got sauna steam ice bath no i'm just kidding bro. like this is the place where they actually 
yeah this is it bro from the amenity point of view not much except for the weighing machine which i pretty the weighing machine that is the one uh forget your in body forget everything i think that is the og weighing machine basically you watch it they they basically watch their physique and they analyze and that's how they get to a body fat percent people here are very old school bro i think if you really got to make gains this is a gym for you to come if you don't want if you don't want no distractions like lighting or anything so this is a gym this is a spot you got to come right uh appo ibudte അഡ്മിഷൻ ഫീ എങ്ങനെയാണ് നിങ്ങൾ അഡ്മിഷൻ ഫീ എന്ന് പറഞ്ഞാൽ ഇവിടെ അഡ്മിഷൻ ആയിരം രൂപ എഴുന്നൂറ് രൂപ ഫീസ് ആയിരം രൂപ അഡ്മിഷൻ അത് അഡ്മിഷൻ മാസം മന്ത്ലി മന്ത്ലി ഫീസ് എഴുന്നൂറ് രൂപ ഓക്കെ ഇവിടെ അഡ്മിഷൻ എടുത്ത് കഴിഞ്ഞാൽ ആയുഷ്കാല മെമ്പർഷിപ്പാണ് ഓക്കെ 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 തൗസൻഡ് റുപ്പീസ് മെമ്പർഷിപ്പ് മെമ്പർഷിപ്പ് ഓക്കെ ഓക്കെ തൗസൻഡ് റുപ്പീസ് മെമ്പർഷിപ്പ് സെവൻ ഹൺഡ്രഡ് ഇസ് എ മന്ത്ലി മന്ത്ലി ഫീസ് സോ ഇൻ എ മന്ത് യു ജസ്റ്റ് ഗോഡ് പേ സെവൻ ഹൺഡ്രഡ് റുപ്പീസ് ഫോർട്ടി ഡോൺ ഗിവ് വൺ ഇയർ നോ വൺ ഇയർ വൺ ഇയർ യു ഡോൺ ഗിവ് വൺ ഇയർ ഇപ്പം പറഞ്ഞാൽ ഇവിടെ വരുന്നവരെല്ലാം കൂടുതലും സാധാരണക്കാരാണ് ഓക്കെ ഓക്കെ ഓർഡിനറി ആ അതെ അങ്ങനെ പോയി പോയി അപ്പോൾ അവർക്ക് ചെയ്യാൻ പറ്റുന്ന രീതിയിലാണെങ്കിൽ നമുക്ക് മാസം തോറുള്ള ഫീസാണ് അവർക്ക് പറ്റുള്ളൂ ഓക്കെ അല്ലാണ്ട് ഇപ്പം ഒരു വർഷത്തെ ഫീസ് അവിടെ ചെയ്യാവുന്ന ഒരു അങ്ങനെ ആൾക്കാർ വളരെ കുറവാണ് ഓക്കെ സോ ആഫ്റ്റർ ടേക്കിംഗ് എവറിങ് ഇൻ ടു കൺസിഡറേഷൻ and just just for the video taking the amenities also into consideration i would want to give this a solid 7 out of 10 if i give anywhere below 7 i don't think i will be doing justice to this gym because the people here are very nice and the equipments here hands down one of the best equipments i have ever tried in my lifting journey but because of the ventilation and things like that i got to give this gym 7 So this was the cheapest gym in Kerala. If I got to say the most underrated gym in Kerala. Now I really want to see what the most expensive gym in Kerala got to offer us. Talking about amenities, the vibe and the lighting. Boss, please 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 give this video a like cuz I have been traveling around making videos for you all. So please give this video a like. All right now let's start with the video Today I'm standing in one of the most expensive gym in Kerala I don't bro it like the gym is located right above Starbucks I don't know how expensive a membership would cost here Let's see let's see So I'm expecting somewhere around 700 to 1000 for a day membership Anyways let's see come let's go Bro like look at this I've gotten the premium vibe already The gym also smells like a new gym, you know, like you know when the gym just started and you can get the new vibes. It's pretty good, bro. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, I'm a little scared to ask them a day membership because this looks very expensive. Let's see. How much does a day membership cost here? Five hundred. It's not bad, bro. Five hundred is pretty good, okay. bro. Like this doesn't feel like a gym. It, it it looks like a restaurant or something. This the vibe here. branding everything they have done in a pretty premium way i feel premium bro that's all i can tell i feel very premium first let's check the locker room not going to lie the locker room seems pretty small here if the crowd is pretty fine then i don't think a gym needs to have a bigger locker room let's see if the equipments are really as good as it, how it looks like yo bro as soon as i entered here you know what i noticed these guys talking about the music oh yeah see can you hear that bro i got i got to do moonwalk right here bro it's pretty insane so vibe check it's definitely passing it i would definitely rate it at least a solid 9 out of 10 gym is very small at the same time it's bloody premium everything is life fitness bulldog and right now i just did one set of shoulder press and i feel amazing bro everything about this gym just fucking excites me so much they got olympia playing back bro bro that's pretty insane i i understand if you don't want to look like that but for me that motivates a lot and if i don't get one rep bro the gym started one and a half month back and these guys got some branches all over kochi you know the equipments here and everything they got variety machines here which i love the most something very special here this machine i have no clue what this is uh full body press it's called that's beautiful 
No, if you genuinely need a warm up, this is the best machine. Best fucking machine, bro. Because I can feel my delts, I can feel my core also, bro. Oh, I love doing this. <laughs> okay, now let's move on. The benches here, everything is pretty, pretty insane. If you all are not into bodybuilding and if you are into uh, powerlifting, this gym it still works for you, bro. Most of the gyms, if you go, if the 25s are supposed to be red, but some gyms you go there, they got their bumper plates, uh, I think some other color, which is not a good sign, honestly. Let's talk about your uh, squat rack. Bro, I feel good. Like standing right below this and holding the bar itself feels amazing. Oh god. Genuinely feels good, bro. Genuinely feels good. Maybe it was the time we had come, but it was very hard to find some people training here. It was just me and one of my friends. But after some time, I finally found one person. How long have you been working out here? So this is my first time, like actually I was back in UK, so I just came here. So Hi. this is my first time working out in this gym. How is the vibe here? Yeah, I feel like the same vibe here because back in UK, I hope you know, yeah, yeah. gyms are like... I mean, I have no clue, but I have not been to UK. But yeah, the gyms in UK are like pretty, pretty big. With for they sure. got sauna, everything, jacuzzi, everything. If you had to rate this gym out of 10, how much would you rate it? And I'll give it maybe 9 because it's really nice here. Yeah. Solid, solid rating bro. Like I said, the equipment, everything is good but we got to check the amenities, alright? Most of the gym when we talk about amenities, you know, we think about jacuzzi, sauna, uh, ice bath. But look at this gym, come. They got a play area for the kids bro. You can come with your family here. Uh, I don't know bro, it's a playground. I don't know if I'm allowed here, but I'm just going in. Bro, what is this? A membership here would cost you anywhere around 21,000 to 24,000 a year. But I really couldn't find any amenities for this price. Hope there's some steam sauna, something real. Like, let's see. One thing I notice here is that but the gym is quite small, but amazing gym, premium gym. Uh, we got a locker room, is also small. We got a kids area, but we don't have a steam room or a jacuzzi or a sauna here. Why is that? That that feels a little weird. But do you have these branches in uh, in the other branches? Do you have steam room, jacuzzi, or anything? Illa. Where? Where are you? Where are you? Are you serious? Why? I <laughs> feel. Damn, that, that, that doesn't make sense for me. Okay. Anyway, if you got to rate this gym in all over Kerala, how much would you rate yeah, it out of 10? Right, 10 nearly, almost 10. 10. Okay. So after reviewing everything in this gym, I'm talking about machines, the vibe, and the amenities. I would have rated this gym a solid 9 out of 10, but just because of the amenities, I would rate this gym a solid 8 out of 10 because their equipments are beautiful the gym got a good vibe talking about the lighting it's pretty insane aesthetics the crowd everything is good except for the amenities so that is all for this video boys if you all want me to do another video where you want me to travel to maybe the northern side of India and check out their gym, review the best gyms they have got, comment down below and trust me, I will be doing it soon. Make sure to give this video a like and subscribe to my channel. Alright boys, until next time it is, peace.